All right, people. So now we're going to react to the Chappelle show. Or the end family. I'm not saying that. Nope, nope, nope. No, no. I'm not. I don't have that color to say that. So a lot of y'all. <laughs> y'all were telling her how she she needs to open her horizon of comedy. That like it's not. They were just making fun of like racism. They were making fun of, like. Yeah. Yeah, they don't actually mean it. Yeah. Yeah. But it's just to make poke fun of it, cause everybody's like, "Oh my god, it's so racist," but it's like. Yeah. You know, oh, uncensored. Yeah. You ready? Okay. You ready? Breakfast is served. Look, hon, my sister just had another baby. Look at this little bundle of joy. She's got those nigger lips. I know. Oh, man. Is Tim still asleep? I think so. He sure is one lazy nigger. Good morning, Mom. Morning, Dad. Good morning. You know, Tim, we're having a dinner party tonight. I trust you'll be here. Oh, I can't. I have my first big date with Jenny Halstead. <laughs> Jenny has a date tonight with a nigger boy from school. What? Oh, God, no. No, Teddy, that's his name, Timmy Nigger. Oh, of course. <laughs> that nigger. He's a very good athlete and so well-spoken. That family's going places. I mean, we're rich. They're nigger rich. Oh, bitch. <laughs> what do you think so far? What? Like, What? I, what I do you think? Know. Is this funny to you? It's it's okay. I you wouldn't see me dying of laughter, but it, this is not your cup of tea. No. Why? Like I've seen funnier it's things. It's pushing the boundaries. But I don't know. Let's just I guess it's just me because I don't find these stuff funny. But how? I don't know. It's just. Why it's pushed in our company. They're nigger rich. Oh, bitch. Why it's pushed in our colored milk family. And it's my favorite family to deliver milk to. The niggers. Mm. Something show sure smells good. You niggers cooking? We sure are. There's some leftover bacon if you'd like some. Ooh, none for me. I know better than to get between a nigga and their paw. I get my fingers bit. <laughs> Here you go. I, I hate to bother you about this, but, uh, well, you didn't pay your bill last week. And I know how forgetful you niggas are when it comes to paying bills. Golly, Clifton, it slipped my mind. Here you go. Sorry about that. Oh, nigga, please. Nigga, please. I have a hot date with the wife tonight. All right, take care. All right, peace, nigga. <laughs> Niggas! Stevenson, party four. Ah, Stevenson, party four. Table five, please. Bon appetit. Nigger, party two. Nigger, party two. Well, look at here, Jack. Just because we're colored didn't mean we came out here to be disrespected, okay? Uh, we're the nigger family. Uh, oh, hi, Clifton. Oh, well, hello, little nigger. <laughs> <laughs> These are the niggers I was telling you about. Are you the nigger that broke the bottle over Ronnie's head at the dice game? No, not that nigger. The nigger from work, the milk route. Oh, uh, okay. We have a nice meal. I bet you'll get the finest table the niggas ever got in this restaurant. <laughs> what do you think so far? Huh? I, I don't know. Like he's literally making fun of like, okay, you know how 
like when he said like where like you want some piece of bacon he's like oh i don't know i don't to get into like n words uh between their their pork and because that's like uh like a joke for like towards black people and stuff like that same thing like right now it's like when he went they were he was calling the name the n-word and he's like well we didn't come here to get respect that he's like oh and then he was talking about them it's just a poking fun out of it. But you're taking no it, fun. You're taking it too seriously. I, I'm trying to find it funny, but I can't. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> this racism is killing me inside. What's your dinner party face on? Hello. Well, you must be the wetbacks. It's Sanchez. Don't call us wet backs, nigger. We find it offensive. I'm just kidding. We are the wet backs. <laughs> <laughs> See? It, it just pokes fun out everything. That's <laughs> all. <laughs> Wait till we tell the Jews. <laughs> oh, you are one crazy nigger. <laughs> So what did you think about this one? It was okay, to be honest. It was funny, right? Some parts. I'm not going to lie. Some parts were, but it's just... It's too much for you? I'm not... Yeah, I will say that it's too much. Or maybe I'm just used to not finding that funny. Maybe that's why. Did, Did you find it offensive? Well, offensive to other people, not one part oh. offensive to me. How but... is it offensive, though? I didn't find none of this offensive. Yeah, because you're used to that. But this is comedy. This is what comedy is. <sighs> there was just... nothing on that offensive. And if you talk to talk to a lot of people, like especially in the comment section, you'll see a lot of them people... They don't find this it's offensive. Because, yeah, it's because a lot of people, like, older people grew up with that not being offensive. It's not that you grew up with it. It's like... Well, they got used to that not being but, offensive. But the, no, but the but... thing is, is the way you say it. A lot, it's like, it's not... It doesn't matter what you say is the way you said it. They weren't saying it as to be like, oh, like, oh, I'm going I'm to F you up, you little N-word and all that. No, they did it as like a playful way. Just like with the, like the, the thing they did with like the Mexicans. They yeah. laughed at it, and, and that's how it is. But that's how people... Nowadays, everything's like, oh, you treat me because of my skin color. It's like, no. Yeah, but... I don't know. No. Like... What do you rate this episode then? Like a seven. Okay, that's a seven. From seven out of ten, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for me, ten, ten. Well, I yeah. remove that. Because for me, the, for me, the... The more offensive, the more like crazy it gets, the more I like it because you're pushing the boundaries. I want you to go out. That's why like Joe Rogan has like a like his own podcast. Not not his own. Well, of course he has his own podcast, but he has his own like comedy show in Texas where you you can say whatever you want about anybody, and that's how it's supposed to be. Like you can't like nowadays you can't make fun of certain people, certain groups, certain groups that. Are certain change their ways because oh certain oh uh, yeah yeah because they want to feel special because they are whatever they think they are they label themselves as cats or do- or worms oh. or whatever they want to because that's the world they live in you oh. can't make fun of those you can't make fun of me because I'm too brown can't make fun of you because you're too white can't make fun of you because you this because you can't make fun of me because of this i don't have a leg i don't have a car i don't have this it's like jesus christ if if if, listen yeah i will say that uh nowadays it's like a bit too much because like yeah you can't make fun of nobody like nobody nobody. yeah and the thing the problem is if you can't handle words how the how in the hell are you gonna handle life if That's words true. hurt you, how can a word hurt you? Hurt you. Words don't hurt. 
Have have I ever said something to you that you're like, oh my god, my my arm hurts. He screamed at me so bad. He said that word that is making my leg hurt. Oh my god, no. So it's like, how in the hell do what does a word hurt you? Maybe it hurts the feelings. Then suck it up. It's life. Life is bad. Anything anything worth working for is gonna be hard. Love is hard. Loving something is hard because it will hurt when it's gone. But what you're just gonna be like, oh no, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go do that because it's hard. Or it's gonna hurt me at the end. If, like... Yeah, exactly. If it's easy, then everybody be doing it. That's true. So it's like, yeah, I don't know. But yeah, we're definitely gonna react to more crazy stuff like this. All right, people, you know what to do in the comment sections. Start judging her for all this stuff. Yes. Nice play. <laughs> but yeah, like uh, open. I want to react to more of this pushing the boundaries um, comedies. Please let us know in the comment section. Thank you all for watching. And what do you all think? Let me know.